Hey guys. I have to talk on my microphone again. Heading to work. Look at this hair. She did it herself. It, it, the only thing, it just makes my forehead so shiny and so big. But I was born this way. I really like it. I got my little outfit going. I put on a cute little jumpsuit with some Gucci loafers and whatever it is. And I put on my Chanel shades, a silk scarf, keep it cute. I really, really like it. It looks like I really dyed my hair. Everyone at work is going to be like, did you just dye your hair? Did you just dye your hair? You were here yesterday. You had dark hair. Ah! I'm like, don't we do hair for a living? What the fuck is wrong with you? I feel like my spirit is coming back to life because when I used to have light hair, I was always vibrant and full of spirit. And I think this is what I'm going to do every time. I'm going to be vibrant and full of spirit. You should be like that every day because every day is a new day and everything is, is, is a new blessing. But at the end of the day, this is life. It's stressful. Oh, yes. I look like this, like, person. Like, who is that person? He's so chic. Like, he has so much money. Maybe. <laughs> Heading off to work. I am being so conceited in the streets. Everyone's looking at me like, why is this bitch looking at herself? I'm looking at all this big forehead and the hair. Because I'm in love with my hair. Leave me alone. Yeah. Going to work. Hope you guys like my wax. <laughs> This is what bitches do with long hair. Uh -huh. <laughs> I need to pee. Can I just like glue this on? I love this. So anywho, hey guys, it's me again. It's a little dark, but I'm peeing at the same time. <sighs> do you hear my jism? You can see this thing in the background. Any. I love gay um, bathrooms, especially here. If you see this background, you would die. You would die. You would die. Oh. <laughs> they don't even have wipes. I love wipes. You need to wipe your dick before you go to my $20 underwear each. <laughs> I want to show you this bathroom. It's like talk about insane. I just pee 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 pee. Let me show you. This is the type of shit they have. Look, oh the light vaginas in a gay place. Titties. Look at those tits. They're fucking amazing. Ah, lipo. I'm documenting my life while I'm smoking. You know what's so amazing is beautiful people. I feel like in this world we don't have beautiful people. No, I feel like we consider beautiful people like because the way they look, it's structure, meaning like their eyes, their nose, their face structure, their lips, their mouth or whatever. But at the end of the day, <laughs> I'm trying to take out the tobacco out of this fucking filter because I don't. Oh, it's empty. Because I. Oh, it's fucking ripped. Seriously. Oh, I can take this filter and make something happen. Hung over and freaking tired. Mm. Last night was so much fun, but I'm supposed to be in the Hamptons right now. I'm supposed to be working right now. I'm supposed to be at my coworker's stop or house or whatever today, actually, at six in the morning. 
And I did not wake up on time at all. I feel, well, I'm hungover. But emotion-wise, I feel so bad because I'm like, I think I need some food to start my energy, my energy, to start my day. I don't even know what to do. I do want to take advantage of this day because I'm like, what the fuck am I going to do now? So I do definitely want to get my nails done and definitely want to get laundry done. And that's it. That's basically what I want to do. I'm just going to do that. I'm so hungover. But it was fun. I feel like I, you know, in the summertime, I'm so busy, so I don't really spend time with my besties. But we're going to get our face done on Sunday. Definitely going to film that. Me and my Denzi, he wants Botox. This is Botox for the first time. And it's, you know, I'm a veteran, and she's a, a version, a version, a version. She wants to get that forehead fixed because she got waves. Love you, boo. But, um, yeah, it was just like catch-up time, and I was super busy yesterday. I wanted a drink. He wanted to um, go to the movies. So I was like, okay, we can go to the movies. What movie did we see? Oh, we didn't even end up going to the movies. We were supposed to see this, like, planet movie thing with that supermodel with eyebrows. What's her name? Whatever her name is. Blonde bitch. No, sorry. Blonde how? No, blonde girl. <laughs> Forget her name. She's like a super bottle or whatever. Anyway, um, it was supposed to be like when we went to a Mexican spot that we always, that we used, we, we, I feel like we like the drinks there, but the best Mexican food is downtown um, by Soho, I think it is, that we used, that we, we used to go. Fucking good. But or we just go to Arriba Arriba, that's in Midtown and that's um, the gay area. <laughs> it's fun. Um. Oh my God! I just want to. I, I want to call. Uh, I want to order food. So we catched up. We had. I had like two margaritas. No, three margaritas because they have like the best flavors. So I had a strawberry, mango, and pomegranate. And then they had two more, but I was like, I don't think I could take two more drinks because I'm gonna fucking go crazy. Then we we're planning to go to the movies. We didn't end up going to the movies, so we like, let's go to a bar, a social club that's in Midtown. Let's go there and have a drink and kiki. So we did, and then where else did we go? Did we go to two bars? I don't even remember. Yeah, we went to two bars, went to Barrage. And we kiki there, and I FaceTime my um, one of my daddy friends that I talked about the day before yesterday. Oh, for, yeah, my grinder moment, and I have making no sense today because I'm so tired. I'm sorry, I'm like, I'm not even tired. It's like I'm hung over at the same time. I hate when I wake up in the morning or when I'm out and it's like the evidence is in your pockets. Always remember that. That's how you know if you had a good night. This is how I know. I have my wallet, my keys, an adapter. <laughs> this is not my lip balm. I lost it, so I had to buy another one. Money, condoms. That's how you know that you had a good night. <laughs> when you got random shit in the house, in your pockets. Oh, you know what's so, what I, I, well, I do remember the night, but you know what's so good? Um, you know there are good people out there in the world and these are my $500 Chanel's. I'm not trying to like be like, oh bougie and be like, look what I have, no. You know, there's some money spent on these glasses. I left them on the, at the social club, on the chair, walked out, went to Barrage, and I was like, oh my God, I just fucking 
lost my glasses. I cannot believe, but I love my bestie. She's always positive. She's always good. I can't wait till you guys see her on TV. And we went and it was there. I loved it. Someone take, gave it to the bartender. I was like, I love you. Thank you so much. Cause I'm like fucking bitch. I am going to be so pissed losing those damn glasses. But I didn't lose them. So it was fine. Oh my God. I'm gonna put them back on their case right now because I'm like, I'm gonna order some food and chill a little bit. And then I can like really, you know, 100% wake up and get my day started. Wow, wow, wow. Cause I'm with you, I just get wild thoughts. What is the number of the fucking place? I think I have it on my Yelp. I want some chicken. Do you want chicken? I think I want, I don't know what I want. 